Hi friends, hope you are doing great. Today we are going to see this demo ingesting a CSV dataset into Google BigQuery. Okay, so let's start the demo. So this is our Google BigQuery. So this is my project. Now I am going to create a dataset, new dataset. I am giving the name as customer. 23 location type i am selecting as multi region then i am going to create a new data set now we have successfully created the data set so now next step is we need to create a table so before that so this is my uh, spreadsheet product details so i am going to in just uh, this csv data set into the google bigquery so that's what we are going to do it so this is in my google drive this is in my drive only okay so now i'm going to create a table so just click this uh, three dots let me close this pop-up message okay this is our data set so now we need to click this three dot and click create table then we have to fill this uh, form okay so source we have to select create table from so i am going to select we are having several options upload drive cloud storage amazon s3 big table now i am going to select as drive so i am selecting as a drive then here we need to update the path select drive url so now go to that my drive so this is my uh, product details i will right click and get link so now you can copy from this copy link and you can go to bigquery then here we need to update this we have to paste it here and here file format we need to select csv then destination project has been updated already so no need to touch anything and data set already it is updated so now we need to update the table name so table name i am giving as product product 2023 whatever name you can give it friends so i am giving the name as table product 2023 so now auto detect schema so schema we need to select auto detect the schema will be automatically generated now we are going to create the table So the table has been created right now. So just click this product on D23. Now you can see friends, uh, this product ID, product name, supplier ID, header file you can see it friends here. So product ID, product name, supplier ID, category, we need price it came. Okay. So we have successfully ingested the CSV data set. Okay. So now next to what I'm going to do means I'm going to run this query so for uh, getting the output i mean for showing to you so just click query and uh, in new tab i'm doing star here select star from then this is my project id this is data set this is table so i'm giving us 10 then run this code you can see the output you can see friends whatever uh, we have given in the spreadsheet inputs so automatically it will reflect here you can see it here okay so now next what i'm going to do is i'm going to replace this product name first i'm replacing with xyz okay then just click refresh whether it will reflect or not so just we are going to check it friends definitely it will reflect so just click refresh it is loading actually okay just let's wait for it just give me a second then click run it run here so the first uh, the name it will be updated xyz yeah friends it is updated right now so you can also check it from your entrance thanks a lot have a great day bye bye